Now our continuing coverage on creating affordable housing in Colorado Springs, a unique rental housing project launching with a plan of bridging the affordable housing gap. It's happening just south and east of downtown Colorado Springs. Our Bill Folsom looking into the project along Han Hancock Expressway. He's live. We're ground. Just about to start moving on that project. Bill. Yeah, we're talking about around 100 units going in here. This is a plan for families uh, and people you just say are the working class. It is a unique business plan in the world of rentals. And while it is business, the developer is doing this with a sense of community. Rental units for working families, a design very different than box style apartments stacked one on top of another. It is a for rent product, but they're in five and six plexes. We call them the great house. They have big front porches. It's designed around shared backyards for kids. One bedroom units, also two, three and a few rare four bedroom units. Designers see a niche for multi-generational family living. The complex is a departure from the successful luxury apartments in downtown Colorado Springs, built by developer Darcy Nicholson. Her sense of community kicked in a couple years back with the mayor's call for more attainable housing. I looked around and I realized that I'm surrounded by a wonderful team of people that helped to build uh, Blue Dot Place downtown and Casa Mundi downtown. Dirt is now moving, the build starting after months of creative thinking. The intent is housing with a bridge price point between high end and supplemented low income. Some local employers are investing in this. The local business owners, they recognize uh, that their employees are having a difficult time finding housing at um, an affordable price. The right price requires figuring out more cost effective ideas. We worked very closely with Colorado Springs Utilities to come up with a new idea, a new way of doing water and sewer lines and we saved a million dollars there. The developer and investors also see opportunity in southeast Colorado Springs. I think there is a really strong sense of community here. Um, and it's a hidden gem in our city. It has a tremendous amount of diversity. It has a tremendous amount of culture. This part of town is also making business sense for this uh, group doing this. If you go that way, less than 10 minutes, you're out to where Amazon is coming in and all the development at the airport. Fort Carson, less than 15 minutes that way. If somebody's working at the Broadmoor, it is less than 10 minutes that way. And of course, downtown, which is more expensive, but from here, you can get there in five to 10 minutes as well. It's all about affordability and accessibility. Watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Bill Folsom, News 5.